Hi. This skill, what we're going to do is a, we're going to change the residence position to a supported sideline position. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through the entire skill and, again, highlight some details that you really need to be focusing on. Okay? Hello, Mr. Smith. My name is Pam. I'm your Cena today. And it's time for us to go ahead and turn you. So let me wash my hands and gather your equipment and I'll be right back. I'm going to lay these right here. Now care plan says that we need to turn you over to this side over here, which is your right side. So we're going to turn you and you're going to be looking that way. Let me pull the curtain. Okay, so first of all, let me go ahead and uh, put the bed up, just to my working level. And you let me know uh, at any time if uh, you're cold or if you have any discomfort. Okay, so what we need to do first is, um, can you scoot over towards me? If you can, I'll be more than happy to help you. Okay, well, we'll go ahead and do this and scoot. Nicely done. Okay, make sure you keep your resident covered at all times. And Mr. Smith, we're going to go ahead and bend up this knee. And I'm going to have you reach this way, and we're going to do this together on three. Okay? One, two, three, turn. Making sure they're recovered. You doing okay? While they're on their back, you can observe the skin condition, anything that you need that way. The first pillow, what you're going to do, if you want to come around this way and get a little bit more of a bird's eye view, you're going to go ahead and you're going to position the pillow in a lengthwise and you're going to fold up, making sure they're safe. They're more or less in the middle. Mr. S um, Smith's back up in just a little bit. There you go. Then you're in the center towards the bed. So that pillow is rolled. Okay, cover them up. Next, Mr. Smith, what we're going to do is we're going to put a pillow between your legs. I'm exposing for you just to see. But in testing purposes, you need to make sure they stay covered. This is part of the indirect for their rights. What we're going to focus on here is that the hip maintains that uh, good level of alignment there. There's no bony provinces touching. The heels are covered. And we're going to go ahead and cover you back up. And we're going to take the last pillow. And we're going to put it under the arm, again lengthwise. This again supports that shoulder. How does that feel, Mr. Smith? Good? And lastly, you go up underneath the shoulder that's on the bed, and you're just going to give a, just a little bit of pull so they're not leaning right on that shoulder. Reposition their pillow for comfort. Mr. Smith, how are you feeling? Are you comfortable? Okay, well I'm going to go ahead and put your call light right here where you can reach it. So you can call me if need be. Let's get these blankets straightened up. Since you're turned this way, I'm going to go ahead and put your bedside table right here so you can get your personal items. And lastly, we're going to go ahead and I'm going to return the bed back down to the lowest position. How are you feeling? Do you have any discomfort on that shoulder? All right, great. And in this skill, it's really important that you make sure that their alignment, their spine down to their hip, sometimes you can go down to the end, and you can visualize it yourself. So, we'll open this back up. Mr. Smith, how's your head positioning? Do you need the head of the bed up at all? All right, great. Okay, call me if you need anything, and I'll make sure I'll get to you right away. All right, have a nice day.
Then I'm going to finish up the skill, double checking to make sure everything's for the quippers, as I taught you in class. And we're going to end the skill with washing our hands, and then you're done.